Hi friends, welcome to Inspire from Universe. This is a travel and educational channel. Is a volcano for a country a gift or a curse? This is what we are going to analyze in this video. You yourself can draw a conclusion if you watch this video fully. We have seen how volcanoes forms, its types, and the hot springs in our United Kingdom bat video. If you have missed watching it, click the link below and watch it. What comes to your mind when we say volcano? A deadly atmosphere, right? Like hot burning lava, bursting and flowing, people, animal and plants die, and the people surrounding the place undergo a major loss, etc. What you think is absolutely correct. But that's not the only face of a volcano. There is another completely good face of it. So let us see the positive side of a volcano here. The first one is the enormous sulfur gas coming out of the crater, raises up to the atmosphere and combines with water there, creating tiny droplets that can stay in the atmosphere for years. The main advantage of these aerosol droplets are the cooling effect it creates in the atmosphere, which we live and breathe. The amazing fact about volcanoes is they have actually helped to keep the world about 2 to 3 degrees cooler than it otherwise may be. Apart from the sulfur, a lot of steam comes out and raises up. Since sulfur already cooled the atmosphere, the steam condenses and pours as heavy rain in a few days after the explosion. In fact, all water what we have in our earth is because of volcanic explosion. Another big plus is the outflowing lava that gets mixed with the soil provides lots of important nutrients. This makes a highly rich fertile soil which is great for farming and crops. Apart from this, heavy rain and fertile soil provide a good environment for the formation of new habitats for animals, plants and insects. When volcanoes explode in an ocean, the lava falls and forms new land surface. This is how all the Hawaii islands were formed. Hot springs and geothermal energy created by volcanic activity are the greatest source of energy in countries like New Zealand and Iceland. Instead of digging the earth for miles and taking minerals out of it, volcanoes give it in our hands through its lava. The lava is rich in sulfur, copper and various other minerals. Even gold is there sometimes. On rare scenarios, it's possible to get even diamonds. Because of all these reasons, as soon as a volcano explodes, in order to buy those volcanic ash, big companies all over the world try to get them from the landowners by paying a hefty price. Hence, Volcano compensates the people with rewarding benefits for the damage it causes to them. Volcanic materials are a good source for building materials in making conglomerate building blocks. Volcanic materials are ground down and used in making cement too. Apart from this, it becomes a famous tourist destination and hence brings lots of revenue to the people there. In a dormant volcano, you can get gas rich in sulfur and steam. But only in an active volcano, we get molten lava out of it. This helps people in their earnings to a greater extent. When we look at the number of volcanoes in a country, USA stands first followed by Russia and in third place is Indonesia. But Indonesia stands globally first in the number of active volcanoes. They have 77 active volcanoes. So though in short term a volcanic explosion creates lots of damage to people living there, in long term it gives them back in many folds. So friends, what do you think now? Is a volcano for a country a gift or a curse? To know many more interesting facts about our world, watch, subscribe, share, like, and comment in Spider From Universe. Until we meet again, take care and bye friends!